Hello everyone, this is Lord Nod at the side of the Intel Extreme Masters in Singapore and we have from all the way from Russia, from Moscow, Dmitry, also known as Happy. Welcome to the show. Uh, hello. So tell me your last name again because it's, it's very interesting to pronounce. It's Question. Question. So Dmitry Question, also known as Happy, I have to say, I have to go ahead and bow down right now, do something like this because this chap, this fellow had such an amazing amount of stamina. You have to tell us, you were on that desk practicing for 18 hours, 14 hours to say 18 hours every day. What gives you that energy? Well, I just have nothing else to do, so I sat down and practice it. I think it will be a waste opportunity if I wouldn't be practicing from here playing on Korean server, which I just cannot play from home. So. How bad is the ping from Moscow to Russia? What? Sorry? The ping the, from when you play uh, from Moscow, from Russia, to the Korean server, no, no, is no. it really bad? I, I am playing on Korean server. Being here, I cannot play from Russia at Korean server. It is impossible. Ping will be uh, completely unplayable. Oh, good. So, how was your experience playing on the Korean server? Well, it's good. It's challenging. Tell us about your play style. You, you know, there's a lot of people who say, Oh my God, this person's a robot. I don't know how he does this. It is so tough. Have you, you've, you've obviously built your own play style and a lot of people are in awe and you know, oh my God, how do you play that? Tell us your m mental process, the way you think before when you play a game. Well, I just try to win, whatever it takes. Uh, I'm more micro-oriented player than the others, so it could be very difficult to play against me on fa fair amount of supplies. Like, uh, when you're not ahead, it will be difficult to win against me. So this is why I always try to uh, play strategies that require the most micro mm -hmm. to win. This is why many opponents do, do, do not like to face me, for example, in very late game stages and so. And how did you get that great micro style? Uh, which other games before StarCraft allowed you to go ahead and develop, develop that kind of style? I was Walker Free Pro Gamer and the game was completely micro oriented, was like no micro at all. So I was having like one of the best micro in the world playing Walker Free. So I'm feeling comfortable uh, playing micro style in StarCraft 2, even despite the fact that I don't think uh, this is the only thing that decides the, the result in this game. This, is, this game is more ma macro oriented. Yeah, well, and some of you have seen those brilliant beauties of him playing his micro style. Now, you know, a lot of people say games evolve and games become better. What's your scene on StarCraft? Now, it's, it's got to a stage where we are at the end of a season. Where, does, where do you go in the next season? Are you looking for the next uh, the Void uh, expansion? What's personal for you uh, for StarCraft next year? Uh, well, I'm looking forward for WCS at the first place and for many other tournaments. I think uh, this was my last uh, tournament for this year, last LAN tournament. I did, didn't make any certain plans for next year, but I think I'll still be playing. Uh, no, no other changes for me. And about next expansion to StarCraft 2, I don't think it will be out next year. Most probably the beta will be at the very end of the next year, but it will come out in 2000, uh, 2015. Good, good. And probably the one of the last things we'll ask him before he is going out is a couple of personal questions uh, which he's been trying to avoid but I'll ask you five questions and you have to answer them really quickly. All right. Okay. Do you like spicy food? No. Uh, <clears throat> do you like Asian food, American food or uh, do you like Asia, America or Europe? Mm, Europe I think but uh, I just eat whatever, whatever I can find at home. As a place to visit, where would you visit on the whole planet? Sorry? If you had a, one place to visit on the whole planet, where would you go? I don't know, but come back home from here. <laughs> uh, if you won WCS, who would you call the first? WCS? Who would you pick up the phone and call and tell? I won WCS. I don't know, my father. <laughs> nice. Um, actually, from the father, and this is not part of this long question, um, how, how important do you think is family in supporting uh, gamers for going and achieving their dreams? No, it matters on certain person. For me, I don't think it's that important. I always was doing everything on my own, so I don't think I need uh, like a huge support. But still, uh, it's always nice to talk about results and uh, my like my achievements and esports. So that's it. Nice. Thank you so much for your time. This is Lord Nod signing off, saying thank you to Happy. Well, and stay playing and uh, become a star. Thanks.